Enemy covered! Keep them busy! We did it! Lester the molester, bro. We got ourselves some military hardware. It's parked out back in my office. All right. We might be ready to move on this thing. Meet me up in the lab. It's, it's, it's not inappropriate! It's... It's another one of your fucking disasters! That's what it is! First you take a hostage, against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her? Are you nuts? She's... She's a 60-year-old housewife! Wow, she's 57! And she thinks that I'm mature! Yeah, well, let me tell you something! 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane! You're not making my situation any easier! Oh, there's a surprise! I knew it would become about you! I miss my family! Oh, you're full of shit! All you ever did was ignore them, and now that they're gone, you miss them! Fucking incredible! I'll tell you what's incredible! Fucking incredible! Hey! You mother... Hey! Why? No! You got me out here! You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit! If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could've stayed my ass in Los Santos! Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Here's the shot. We're going to Palato Bay, and we're going to do this thing. Any questions? Comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. That crazy motherfucker was with us now. He would have loved this. Instead, he's got to enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody else? What about me? You'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in, they grab the tape, they rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Is that a work for everyone? Great, let's go. Polito Bay, let's hit this shit. You ever hit a bank before, Franklin? Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar pulled. Guess it's the same kind of shit we doing now, right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Come on. Everyone rem- Not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah, 20. Five years ago, Jesus! You, generic goon! What was your first bank score? Okay, we're doing this? Uh, Robin Stash Baston Khan, I guess. Let me think. First real lick. Uh, all right, yeah, armor car. When we spoke down in these laws, know what I'm saying? The honey coming. Yeah, so how much you take? 200, thousand. Oh, big dog. First time out. Had to send most of it up the ladder, yo. Repping Bagos, homie? Yeah, so that was when I went independent. Man, I hear you on that one. Hey, your turn to share, kid. I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death. Pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here, soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember... If he don't remember? I'm supposed to trust this man with my life, and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job? Well, how about you? Why don't you share with me? 
Why don't you share with the group? I'm here. I'll back the facts. A check's cash place? I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Yeah. It was a bit more complicated than that, though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew... Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did six months. Maybe I was out in four, and that, children, is why we don't leave witnesses. That, children, is why you don't rob people that you know. <laughs> yeah. Franklin, share. Yeah, come on, kid. You can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man, shit. Okay, the score was dead. The score was like two stacks, man. 2G, take home on your first gig? Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Die pack went off, homie. All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, get ready, because we're gonna wanna go ASAP. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. All right, you know where you gotta be? I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you! We ready for this? I could use a restroom break. And risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. I gotta go! It's number two! Y'all ready? Let's go! Let's do it! This is stink up! Get on the ground! Today's going one of two ways, friends! Everyone on the floor! Now! You getting off on this, little man? You and you! Out from behind the counter! That's it! Hands in the air! What the f***? Ah. Keep an eye on our trusted employee! Okay! You got the crowd! On the floor! Have to be here soon, so keep it. Die out. I think I've got proof. Keep the door down, Em. Just sit this out. If I ever meet this alarm guy, I'll fucking shoot him. Yeah, not if I get to him first. Yeah. Stay back. We got hostages. Shit. Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. <laughs> Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways of beating it. Move it! Call up procedure! You know you're surrounded, so you ain't getting a ride to the airport! I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the hostages go, and, uh, we'll talk like gentlemen. Time to face the music! Sweet. Mother shit. Let's move! On the lay! Ah! They're on to us! Don't fence me in! Let's 
score to buy one of them unwieldy motherfuckers! It's too heavy! You wanna play dead? We won't be playing! Hey! Hey! Through here! Right along! I'm 
I'm cool. Just keep going. There's even more of these bastards. Find cover. <laughs> of them outside. We might be okay if we make it to the train platform. What the? The platform. Let's go. Give us a minute. Just hold them back. Keep it under control. Hey, asshole. The train. It's our only shot. It's here. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Right here. Get on. Let's go. Yo, uh, easy, easy. I'm a friendly. Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. Yeah, if you expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay, and here's your cut. Considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. Oh yeah, that's a huge fucking win. Woo! Monsters. I'm out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the Worlds ago. Catch your crew together, okay? Fucking punk. All right. We should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you, home. Hey. Fuck. See, Bill. Serious? end up here, I've clearly made some very bad decisions. Trevor about? He's probably out somewhere drinking human blood or eating household pets. <laughs> He's not that bad. Really? Well, okay, he is pretty bad. But he's got a sensitive side. Oh, yes, he's very sensitive. When he gets his feelings hurt, he's devastated. So what's your story? I ain't got a story. I'm an independent thinker. Living out here, away from the man. From what I can tell, you're like a high school athlete. Living off old glories. You used to be able to manage heat. And now, you're worried if your loafers are getting scuffed. Any more bullshit comes out of your mouth, you're gonna learn all about my past glories firsthand, you understand? <laughs> Absolutely, sir. That came out wrong, all wrong. Tell Trevor, the monthly train is coming through. What monthly train? THE monthly train. Where have you two been? Getting some fresh air. Talking of beautiful things. <laughs> yes, I hear Stockholm Syndrome is very nice this time of year. Oh, hey, watch your mouth, boy, all right? It's always been a dream of ours. The train of dreams. The hell are you talking about? I'm talking about gold. 
Enough to keep Ron in trailers and you in therapy. Enough so that we can pay off that Mexican and get you back in town, baby! Yeah! <laughs> this better be fucking good! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Fuck. Ah. Oh. Man, we've talked about this hygiene thing before, bro. I invite you into my home, this is how you repay me? It's like living with a fucking horny skunk. Be under Rat and Canyon Bridge in a boat. We'll stay in touch on the headsets. run by <laughs> Merriweather. Oh, Merriweather? Tranquilo, Mike. This ain't a weapons train. It's goods too valuable to insure for air travel trade. Gold. Sometimes gold. Sometimes artwork. Priceless antiquities. Sometimes enough for you, me, Ron, everyone. Fine. Like a mirage in the desert. Here's my train. Don't leave without me! Mike, oh yeah, another thing for your shopping list. We'll need some bombs. Okay, I'll pick them up when I'm back at the trailer. Back at the trailer? Where are you? We got work to do. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's why I'm getting changed. Whoa, 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 getting changed? What if, what have you turned into? I've got a ticket! Hold up! Conductor on this train. You on the water? Sure, just caught a fish. Let me know when you need me. Got it? Eat it? Be under that fucking bridge. When we go past Polito Station, all of Merriweather's gonna be on to us. Quite a spot you pick. Enjoy it now, because it's about to start raining fire. Oh shit! Shit! Oh. The scars in the orange container. Plant the charge. 
Now, well, what would I blow up a train to steal? Don't be smart. Find the loot. Our moment of judgment is fast approaching. Scar's getting wet, Mikey. Open up that freight car. In time! I'll be as quick as I can be. I gotta run a fucking salvage operation in here. Merryweather recovery teams arrived! Stop looking for your tiddler and find the loot! at this rate. Come on! Keep them away from me, man! I'm looking! Yeah! Got one of them! Speed it up! Grab something! Let's go! Hey! You ain't motivating me! I'm moving as fast as I can! Shooting in now. I'm out here doing the hard work while you're in there relaxing. Find something. Snipers are down, so don't let that keep you. Baby on board, we're good to go. Finally, come on. All aboard. In the boat! Come on! Down the rapids, if you please! They got some boats after us! Nature, you're right. It's a beautiful thing. There's nothing natural about this. Nada! Get these boats off of us! The ground forces are on us! Ha! You're dead! Hey, team! Check the coast! <laughs> hey, help! Good thing you changed clothes! You couldn't have done this without that weird vest thing! You! We got a buzzard on our tail! Ha! Fuck you! You feeling alive? Juice pumping through your glands? My glands are just fine. Without the crashing trains, exploding helicopters, and sinking boats. There's somewhere we can pull up just down the coast. Whoa, man! You work hard for your living. Boil it down for me. How much you think you make for a senseless killing, huh? Couple nickels? Times are tough. Have been since we put you in the ground. Hey, you had your savings. That I couldn't access because you blew the identities. 
You know, there was nothing for Brad's defense. Man didn't even get a trial, just popped up in Supermax. Ron organized some transport for us. Oh, his and hers, huh? Because of your independent spirit. Hey, 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 hey! Hey, before you go, show me the loot. I... It's perfect. Perfect for fucking what? For squaring things with that Mexican psycho. We give him this, and you end your relationship with that little lady. Maybe we won't be Deadman in Los Santos. I don't fucking see that Silicon City again. It'll be too soon. But this is my job, not your call to make. Nah, nah, your job. Fuck things up with the Mexican to begin with. My job, my score, get uh, your own! Wait, you give me that case, I'll give you something bigger. Oh. What? Union Depository. Fuck off. Can't be done. I never said impossible. Just very difficult. Verging suicidal? That a line you're afraid to cross? Come on, T. You remember the dreams? Couple kids pulling jobs, the big one. I know it sounded crazy back then, huh? But hey, you and me together again. With Lester and Franklin on board. We can do this thing, T. This ain't no dream no more. Nah. You keep the case. Fuck me. Okay, hey! All right. Here. Keep that silly fucking thing. And you can keep Patricia as well, all right? Because I respect that lady and I ain't gonna hold her back. <sighs> Thank you. Just remember, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you every day. Inch of the way, all right? Of course. And if that bastard fucking cheats on her one more time, mm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know, Trevor, we both know you're not the marrying guy. But hey, it's great to be back in business, huh? Let's bring it on. The big one! The big one! Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael, business. Uh -huh. All right? I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Uh -huh. You know, you know, Franklin, <laughs> if there's one thing that you're gonna learn from being around us, please just... fucking insanity. Then they can't fry you. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck is useless. Oh, oh, ho, hold on, man. Can y'all knock this shit off? Oh, look! Boys, your boys, it's the feds. Hey, where's the other three? What other three? We told you to bring along six. This is a six-man job. No, you didn't. You Dave did? No, Dave didn't. You said you'd do it. That is a frickin' lie. I do not get things wrong. All right, great. Then we're out of here. Uh, uh, fuck uh, uh, it. Let's go. You three can do it alone. And die, fuck you. You do your own dirty work. Hey, I do my dirty work every day, keeping the country safe from scum like you. And you're doing a great job, sir. Hey, you want this job done? Then come with us, huh? Come on. Come on, Mr. Leisure Wear, Mr. Depressed Accountant. Let's go save America. Who the fuck are we saving it from this time? This is the real deal. My sources are convinced there's a plot in international affairs, you know, the agency, and they're using this facility to make a serious nerve toxin. <laughs> Bullshit. Yeah. 
which they plan in their mind-blowing insanity to let a major terrorist release on a metropolitan area so they can continue to get funding. Nothing increases funding for fighting terrorism more than successful acts of terrorism. <laughs> so, so, all right, so let me get this straight then. No, 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 You're... no, 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 there is no getting it straight. That's the point. Now we're doing this. You two are on getaway. Fuck off and make it happen. Michael, you're with us. What size flipper you wear? Agent Norton, it's been a while since you were in the field. The sight of you in neoprene is something we say for our worst enemies. Shut up, I'll be fine. And you, get in. You're driving. Go down the coast. The facility's a few clicks south of us. Listen to me, Steve. No wisecracks, got it? No fucking cliches. We're fighting for the freedom of the people today. Don't lecture me on patriotism. You've been living outside the system too long. Social responsibilities, a joke to you. So maybe I redeem myself, get killed in the process, huh? That old bullshit. No one is dying on my watch. Not even the burnout bank robber with temper issues and nothing to live for. A hero's death is too good for you. You'll die in the ignominy you deserve. Oh, thank God. Fate shall carry me safe through these selfless acts of charity. This is the bay. We can get in through the discharge tunnel. Here it goes.
what this job is. I only get to know the criminals who are dumb enough to get themselves caught. Yeah, only I wasn't caught. Remember? I turned myself in. He makes a point. That makes you doubly dumb. Born ready. Let's do this. Come on, Dave. What's the plan? Hey, hey, hey. We locate the toxin and action our escape strategy. That's what we got. Great. Lead the way. Bank robber, set your phaser to stun. Hands up, you, now. Against the wall, quick. Oh, heck. Oh, heck. Give it to him, Townley. And look like. You're on a need-to-know basis, bank robber. Shut it. Elevator's coming down. Someone's on board. Oh, no. Get the pass. Next floor. Come on. How you feeling about this? I'm feeling pretty damn fine. Yeah, if only your camera crew was here. Round to the right. Come on. Clear. Let's go. Two lab geeks. Gotta deal with them. Take what you want. I don't care. I don't want to die. Please. We gotta keep moving. Corridor goes around to the left. Let's keep moving. I'm through here. Security detail about to make a pass. They're on us. Make a judgment call. I'm a... <laughs> They've gone. We've got some time. You got the access card. Swipe us in. Exit. There's a lab rat in with the toxin. Let's do this. Open the door. What's going on? Door can only be triggered internally. Wait, someone's coming. I got this. We dropped your buddy. Now open the door before we blow it and drop you. The special agents have the door. Go in there and secure our nerve agents. <laughs> This will make me the most dangerous man in the country. I'm also the most shit scared. Oh man. Thank you, federal government. The toxin is volatile. We need to get it into a refrigeration unit. Facility security has been compromised. Warning, warning. Gotta get out of here. Use a real gun. Agency security. Left, 
left, up here. Push for the exit. Corridor goes around to the left. Don't 
one. Funky guy shot himself so he could pass as a double agent. Ah, well, maybe they'll debrief him with a 12-inch aluminum flashlight. Hanks took the easy way out. We're the ones hoping we'll outrun the agency response team. I think Franklin's the one taking the easy way. Guy's got his feet up in an aircraft hangar. Look, let's just get to the airport so we can finish this bullshit. When you drop us, I'll take the nerve agent. Mr. Phillips, can I trust you to dispose of the chopper? I got more important things to worry about messing around with this stupid chopper. Like things that actually mean something. Not made up wars, with made up enemies. Matters of the heart. Is he fucking with me? Probably not. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davy? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davy, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Huh? You and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. What is this? Oh, fucking A. Yes! What's up, man? My days in the wilderness are over. Lester, he settled up with that crazy Mexican motherfucker. Gave him the artifact. <laughs> now, as long as Trevor handles the wife, we're good. But what about him, man? Yeah, fuck him. He likes the desert. Besides, we do one big score, we're all gonna have to go our own separate ways anyway. Oh, man. I can't wait to get back to that movie studio. <laughs> Yo, all right, man. Well, shit, I'll holler at you later then, all right? What a shit show. I'll tell you what, you could take this desert and stick it. My life may be a world of pain, but from here on out, it's gonna be cool, comfortable, air-conditioned pain. <laughs> take it easy. Wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. I know! You have a great pain inside you. But you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. For some, for some reason. Everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. <laughs> she mistreat you. I know. I know. Baby, bad boy. <sighs> no, stay. You better 
treat her right, man! I will, amigo! Yeah, otherwise, the other ear! Of course! Uh, the way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Uh, good friends. Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect! Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will. I miss you already. What the F word are you doing here? That's a funny way to greet your cousin. You ain't my G-damn cousin, Trevor. I thought we was family. P please, just go and ruin somebody else's home furnishings. Who the F is that boy? No one, my sweet. Hey, by any chance, did you catch crabs at that conference? Ah, boy! I heard that those conferences are regular little fuck fest, huh? Guy, come in. Huh? I'd like you to leave mm. right now. Oh, yeah, some serious corporate gang-banging going on, right? Yeah, with every executive and director of communications from here to Bangalore taking it left, right, and center in the name of team training, right? I mean, now that's what Floyd told me yesterday as he was staring at my, uh, my penis. I want you to leave now! <laughs> Look, this is all I've got, all right? I had a tough upbringing. My daddy was not nice to me! Okay? Now look, Deborah, I love you and I love you too, Floyd. Why can't we all just be together? Huh? You can have Mondays through Thursdays. You can have the weekends, all right? I know that's not normal, but in this crazy, crazy world, is normal so good? Huh? Look, Deborah, Floyd, will you marry me? Get out of my condo! And you go too, Floyd! I told you, I've got a career! I don't need this! 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 Crap! Yes! There. <laughs> you made me swear. You're crap, Floyd. Crap! <laughs> You're not a man at all. <laughs> Bob's right about you. Oh, who's Bob? I want both of you to go now. You and your weird friend. Whoa! Hey! My name is Trevor, sweetheart. I could give a fuck what your fucking name is! I'm not afraid to use this. I'm not. Bob taught me. Fuck Bob! You people are not very fucking nice! <sighs> oh, hey there, Trevor. <laughs> oh. mm, hey there, Wade. Did you meet Gebra? Interesting lady. I should probably go say hi. I wouldn't. Why not? Let's go get in the car, all right? Let's go have the time of our lives. Oh, I know exactly where to take you. I could run in and get Floyd and Deborah. I know she seems kind of uptight, but she can have fun. Mmm, no. I don't think she can, Wade. Just Floyd, then? Floyd's gonna meet us there. Boy's trip! Exactly! Oh, Trevor, what have you got all over yourself? You're all red. You got... you got syrup? Yeah! Syrup. Accidents. We've all been there. We sure have, but... But it don't taste like syrup. Don't taste me, all right? Just no licking. Okay. Hey, you remember when we met? Sure. Last year. I was on the way to the gathering with Daisy Bell and Kush Chronic and... And you stopped in Sandy Shores to get lit and you met it. Gee! 
You met a dealer and he looked after you when your friends had abandoned you. That was weird, weren't it? The last time I saw him, it was with you driving out to the quarry, and then they just disappeared. Trevor! Poof! <laughs> right? I mean, they were gone. Some friends, right? And now Cousin Deborah don't want you around? I mean, there's a pattern here. The Congo did get messy. The pattern is you can't rely on anyone, anyone except me. Look, this is it. So this is where Floyd is going to meet us, the strip club? Oh, yeah. That's unlike him. He's a real homebody. He loves that apartment. Interestingly, you and me, we got a new home. Where? <laughs> here! Mm, right here! Here? Mm, here. Now, I know it's unconventional. Hey, Lester. Hey, uh, Trevor just called about the, um, the big one, the, the UD. You know anything? Yeah, I told him we could hit it. You down? Of course I'm down. Look, I'll get my research together and meet you at Trevor's. He's taking over the Vanilla Unicorn Gentlemen's Club. All right, message Franklin. My boy, Mike! Good to see you! Damn, I need a drink. Ain't that motherfucking true. Sometimes I miss the sunlight. You ratchet, motherfucker! You cock-eating asshole! Hey, before you ask, the fridge is broken. That's all right. I've had enough of your hospitality already. I have changed my ways, all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm done with that crazy shit, all right? I want to square things away with Merriweather, make sure the agency ain't coming back after us, and then do one last big score, and then you get to go back with your family. Me, I'm just going to live here. I'm going to run this, this good business showing people a good time. B bust Brad out of prison, and then, you know, Happy. <laughs> so how'd you come by this place anyway? I've had it for ages. So you must know Leon, the old manager. Leon? I didn't know. Yeah, whatever, man. So what's going on here? What's going on is the big one. A long, long time ago in a faraway place, there were three guys. Michael, Trevor, and Lester. And Brad. Uh, yeah. Sure, Brad was there sometimes as well. I mean, there were other guys, though, too. So, uh, anyway, we, uh, robbed and lied and we hurt people. Pretty much lived a low-life kind of existence. But always dreaming of one thing and one thing only. The big one. The big one. The, the big, big one. one! What is the big one? <laughs> the Union Depository. Around 200 million in gold bricks, all taken from kindly Uncle Sam, who will spend the rest of our lives being hunted by government officials if 
we live through the attempt, but... But! It'll be my, uh, our masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. Taking the temperature? Yeah, you know, getting a feel for it. Security, exit routes, general vibe. All right. That doesn't look like much. Man, security looks light. We send in a couple of sprung niggas, clap, clap. What are you talking about, Frank? Oh, I see it. Man, getting in the door is easy. It's a standard bank. It's getting underground that's hard. Ain't that where the metal's kept? Right. Now we got to stop outside the Arcadia Center down on Alta Street. We can get a view of the back from there. You'll get 20%. We're down on Alta Street, coming up on the back of the bank. A maximum of 200 million if I can get the funds diverted and you pull it off. Still, come on, 20% of that's a lot of coin for sitting on your fat ass. Is it too much to ask for a little respect? Just a little? Because I respect you, Trevor. Strangely, I do. I can see how you're useful. Terrifying, but useful. Oh. Well, I can think of a few uses for you, you chubby little ball of fun. I want your help. All 20% of 200 million of it. Actually, man, I've got another job I want your help with after this. Yeah, right. Whatever. No. Seriously, man. A big job. Payment up front. It's too 
driven off the road into the river. We could recover the cars. With the right equipment, we'd haul them up the side. A central station is monitoring the car's positions. If the GPS tracker reads it's down there in the channel, we'll have red flags all over the place. Fine! Six in sight. Stand by. Hey, I was expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Onion 86 in the building. Now, if I remember from planning the tool store job, they're excavating the new LS Metro Tunnel around here. They take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that! Looking for a big asshole! Get us options. There's you, a guy I know I can depend on. And then there's Trevor. Ah, yeah, Trevor will get it done. And Willie? I hope so, man. I hope he holds it together. Hey, you ain't done too good of a job at that yourself, you feel me? Yeah, well, I ain't pissed off hillbillies. Bikers, a Mexican gang, some Chinese gangsters, 
and a private arm, okay? So there's that. Yeah, but you just pissed off the FIB and the IAA. And your family, man. You know what? I met Amanda, and I know who scares me the most. <laughs> Point taken. So you gonna tell me about this Brad dude and the deal with the FIB? What happened in North Yankton back in the day anyway? This ain't the time. Man, we're about to go in together on the biggest job ever being pulled. There ain't ever gonna be a better time to fill me in on this shit. It's complicated, all right? Fuck it, I'ma ask Trevor. Don't ask Trevor. Shit, man, you sound shady, dawg. Real shady. We'll talk, all right? Just later. All right, holla at him. Hey, when he's got something, Lester will be in touch. <laughs>